um, with regards to actions considered by the new government should work to address issues in the legal system as a whole and in problematic law and in problematic long-term official practices that undermine basic rights like the freedom of expression, association, assembly and religion, freedom from arbitrary detention, and the right to fair trial, and the right to life. Um, thank you very much. Uh, I was Such laws include the country's 1986 press law, the computer crimes law, and aspects of the Islamic penal code that allow for the application of the death penalty for crimes that do not meet the most serious standards, like drug-related offenses. It also includes the retention of cruel and inhuman punishments, such as stoning and amputation, and the retention of broad and poorly defined national security laws. I also highlighted the problematic custodianship law that would allow a man to marry his adopted or foster daughter, who can be as young as 13 years old. That's a very simple answer. Uh, I am, however, very pleased to see that there is now a greater openness in Iran to talk about the impact of sanctions, and therefore a desire to engage with countries concerned to ease those sanctions. And uh, I, I'll be very happy if that should happen, because obviously, you know, sanctions don't help people realize their uh, fundamental rights. And th therefore, any move to ease those would be, would be welcomed. Well, um, the way <laughs> there's a new government in Iran uh, since August uh, this year, having made, uh, taken some small steps which are to be welcomed. Um, and also um, pledging or speaking uh, a language that's, that speaks well for human rights uh, changes, and a, a president who came into office on a platform of human rights uh, um, reform. But he hasn't yet had time to implement any of those things in a meaningful fashion. So uh, it would be wrong to assume that things would have changed in the three-month period uh, for the period we've seen in the past so, so many years. The, the trend I had observed uh, over the past three years is one of uh, generally worsening human rights uh, uh, situation. 